time now for Eyewitness News. Cause called for action. It's sick of robocalls. Well, who is it? Now, even though you may be on the national do not call registry, you may still be getting unwanted calls from telemarketers. And tonight, consumer reporter Susan Hogan has a solution to get rid of them once and for all. Although the do not call registry is good, it doesn't go far enough. A call to over action found an inexpensive device that may be your answer to unwanted and annoying telemarketer calls. Laura Miller has a message for robocallers, and it plays automatically when one tries to call. If you are a telemarketer or a solicitor of any purpose, please hang up. This $40 call blocker by Sentry answers her home phone and only lets callers through if they press 1, something a robocaller can't do. I just forewarn anybody that I know that's calling that they're going to have, they're going to get that message. And Laura says she's now stopped getting calls from telemarketers as well, something the do not call list was not able to do. What many people don't realize is the registry only applies to calls coming from outside of your state. So in some states, local telemarketers may not be breaking the law. So while the national do not call registry is a great tool to stop legitimate out-of-state telemarketers, but there are a growing number of products intended to block all of the others. Anonymous call rejection is free. Just dial star 77 from your landline to block calls from blocked numbers. And for unwanted calls to your cell phone, well, there's an app for that. Several, in fact. Privacy Star screens calls and rates them red, yellow, or green based on the calling activity and complaint history of that number. Then there's Nomo Robo, the winner of the FTC's robocall challenge. The free service screens out illegal robocallers and telemarketers, but only works if you get your phone service through your cable provider. However, Laura says this little device has all but stopped unwanted calls to both her and her elderly mom. Most telemarketers should not call your number once it has been on the registry for 31 days. If they do, you can file a complaint. You can also register your home or cell phone for free. You can do all of that right now by going to our website at WPRI.com and clicking on the Call 12 for Action link. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center. Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, our hotline is 228-1850. I'm Susan Hogan. Eyewitness News.